Welcome to Tech Brothers with Ahmed. Today we are going to answer this question. What is error output? Can you redirect rows from sources, transformations and destinations in SSIS package? So when we are talking about sources, transformations and destinations, that means we are talking about data flow task. And when we are talking about the data flow task, that means we are reading data from different sources, implementing different transformation to clean the data, to aggregate the data, to merge the data and finally write the data to the destination that can be table flat file or excel or different other uh, destinations as well so let me give you one example if i'm reading the data from a flat file and then i will be using flat file source now i have defined some data types or the columns i'm going to read and uh, for the input columns and then i'm going to output some of the uh, columns and i will define their uh, data types as well in the file um, flat file connection manager so if uh, I get a file that does not qualify that data the data in the file does not qualify with the data types so what I have defined in the uh, flat file connection manager what it will happen it will fail the task but uh, with that we might don't want to do it if there are this is a hundred thousand records and there are two records uh, they are uh, creating the trouble why we should be failing the package maybe we can redirect those rows uh, to the some other um, file or maybe a table and we can take a look and load uh, all those remaining uh, good records uh, into the table in that case uh, these uh, sources transformations uh, and destinations uh, they do provide us uh, error output error output is the uh, output uh, that's where we can redirect uh, the rows uh, that doesn't not qualify um, um, according to the data type or maybe the truncation error uh, that, that or uh, the, there are different reason like uh, you cannot put uh, le let's say is null value well, cannot be put in the column uh, in the destination and uh, that can be also reason you are redirecting so assume that uh, we we have different uh, sources uh, such as uh, uh, flat file source that can be you know having uh, some uh, bad records uh, so we need to redirect so we can redirect the rows uh, by using a flat file source so we can redirect the rows uh, from OLEDB source as well and uh, we can uh, in the transformations or when we come to the data conversion transformation we can uh, redirect the rows if the data conversion um, we apply on the column and the value does not uh, or cannot be converted so in those cases uh, we can uh, redirect those rows or if the truncation error happen maybe the string is too long and we are we have defined uh, uh, some string in a small size and uh, if the income in uh, string is really big uh, that truncation error happen and uh, we redirect that row by using drive column transformation and in the same goes in the destination if uh, is null is defined on a column and uh, we are trying to put null values or uh, the value data type is defined different and some input uh, values come in different uh, and that cannot be converted to the destination data type or maybe truncation error uh, could be one reason so we can redirect those rows from the destinations as well um, so uh, to shorten this out yes we can redirect the rows uh, you know to the error output in sources transformations and destination thanks very much for watching this video and i will see you in next video